How would you characterize where you are right now? It's, it's a little bit of it's a little bit of everything. I yeah. would say. Curious, you know, a little nervous and exciting because it's a new chapter, but kind of don't know what to expect, what to think. So. What you nervous about though? Um, uh, you know, just making sure I make the best decision. Yeah. You but, know, and also feeling like I, I get what I know I work for, you know? Yeah, you, so you, when, you worked hard for it. You, when, when, you, when you think about making that decision and you don't know where and you don't know the specifics, but do you have sort of a checklist, like things that really matter <clears throat> to you that will help you decide? Because they're obviously going to be serious. What you mean? Getting paid. Well, getting paid, clearly. But what, you know, what else matters to you, Robbie? Um, you know, I want to be in an environment. I want to win, more importantly, more than, you know, obviously the money, that's everything. That's the name of it. It's the business. But I want to go so I'm going to win and I'm going to get to be the player I can be. What do the Jets need to do to get you back signed up with them? Call my agent. Oh, yeah, that's see, it. See, so, if I was the Jets right now, I tell you, I don't even need to know numbers or nothing. Just seeing you play and judging against other guys like Shepard with the Giants and where his numbers are, I probably would offer you something in a $12 million a year range. Give myself a little wiggle room, maybe the 13, somewhere in there, because you are right now, as far as the receivers go for the Jets, you're the only guy. Right. Now, they can go draft a guy to pair with you, but they shouldn't allow you to hit the free agent market because I'm sure the New England Patriots or somebody like that would love to have you. Yeah. Robbie, let me ask you this. You said uh, you want to win and, mm -hmm. and you wanted to go to a place that would allow you to win. So what is that? Is it the quarterback? Is it the coach? Is what, what, in your, what in your mind allows you to be a successful team and win? Um, I think that starts, it starts from top to bottom, you know. Who's that, the coach? No, from the upstairs. All, all, know, all the way up top. Yeah, everybody in the whole building has to be on the same page, you know, when you look at teams that consistently win. Do you want to go west, stay east? You don't really care? Um, I mean, not really 100% sure on that. Obviously, I want to be somewhere that I enjoy outside of football. So, but... You know, there's some great teams in the middle of the country, you know, like Green Bay. He's not real. Kansas you know what? City. Here's the thing. He's not about to ask anybody on, out right now. No, let me tell you right now, just based on his outfit and his look, that's a West Coast or an East Coast yeah, for me. Yeah, it, it, uh, it doesn't scream middle America. No, it doesn't. He, you know, no, fashion. things have happened. And no, you're, you're into fashion. fashion. That's, yeah, that's a good. thing for you. Tell me about yeah. that. When did you, when'd you become interested in fashion? Oh, I always, you know, I was always into, you know, my clothes and things like that. Even as a, as a little type? Yeah, probably more so then because I probably couldn't have certain things. You know, oh, so okay. I wanted certain things. But, you know, I always um, pride myself in my appearance. and. I like that look. My... That's a very studious look, right? Well, not that one. Uh, that's a different look. That's what a, is that? I, I, Wendy, you better no, watch I it. Like the, I like it. That's a, that's a, that's a, a, a fashion No, that's just a, look. You, you're straight, though. You, yeah. you know, that's the culture. That's where he's at. That's Your mom's society. nodding her head, by the way, that you have been particular about this for a long mm -hmm. time. So, yeah, listen, no, I was, I'm not knocking Kansas. They got great I was great wondering fashion, if I could do the locks, though. Yeah, you, yeah, could, most you think I can rock that? Man, easy. No, Listen, my kids are laughing. Yeah, no, man. yeah, exactly. You got no, <laughs> no ground to stand on. Let me ask you about Matt Rule because you played for him at yeah. Temple, and obviously he becomes a, mm -hmm. a head coach in this league with the Carolina Panthers. Do you like that hire? What will he bring to Carolina? Mm -hmm. Will he bring Robbie Anderson to Carolina? That might be a better question. I mean, who knows, you know, but I definitely, I could really see him in, you know, within the next five years. I really see him, you know, probably winning the Super Bowl. Knowing, knowing, knowing his mindset, knowing the culture that he creates and the environment he creates for players, you know, he makes it easy for you to be a player. You just go out there and do your job. He accepts people for the, who they are, you know, but he's a winner, you know, that's, that's just in his blood. Now, you see what he's done in the past with, with programs, and I know he can do that in the NFL. They need a receiver down in Carolina. You want to go play with Cam? I wouldn't mind to. I love Cam. That's my big dog right there. Okay. Right there. I can see Cam. I don't know. I mean, you got an Asia, but Kiki here remember. No, no, I'm that. just, I'm just know, asking. That's all. It's all good. It's all right, uh, Robbie. Let, let me ask you this: uh, If you, if you're pitching yourself and, and you're you're going into these teams and you're saying, "Hey, I'm here. You know what I can do on the field? Mm -hmm. Here's what else I am. What else are you?" I mean, you know, I'm a I'm a hard worker. You know, I, I'm I'm gonna say I'm not gonna say things just to say things. You know, but when I say things, it's heartfelt. I mean it. You know, and I lead by my actions more than anything. You know, and I'm I'm a team player. You know. Obviously, if we, we lose a game and I know I didn't contribute, I'm going to be frustrated. But if we win a game and I didn't contribute, I'm not going to be mad because that's the ultimate goal, you know. But I'm just looking to win, you know, work hard and, you know, be a great player. Do you expect to hear from the Jets at all? I mean, I would hope so. I expect to. You know, I think, I think they definitely want me back. You know, all and I truly do want to be back with the Jets, you know. 
I love Sam, you know, I love my teammates, Jamal, you know, all those guys. And, you know, I feel like it's unfinished business there that I've been trying to get done since I got there. So, you know, I would hope to finish out the mission all in all, but. And you, you know, do understand business. the NFL is a business. Yeah, it's a business, so I understand that aspect of it, and that's just the reality of it. Thank you for watching ESPN on YouTube. For more sports and analysis, download the ESPN app and for live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.